The Turritopsis Dornii Jellyfish. Hello everyone, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, our name is Edutainment Niche, and we are passionate about bringing you the most interesting and educational content on the internet. Today, we want to talk about a truly amazing species of jellyfish called the Turritopsis Dornii. So, before we start, can you please give us a like and subscribe to our channel? It's the only way you can support us to go forward. Thank you very much. This jellyfish is known as the immortal jellyfish because it has the ability to revert back to its juvenile state after it reaches maturity. This means it can essentially live forever, as long as it doesn't get eaten or killed. So, let's dive into the fascinating world of the Turritopsis dornii and learn more about this incredible creature. Before we get into the specifics of the Turritopsis dornii, let's start with some basics about jellyfish. Jellyfish are marine animals that belong to the phylum Cnidaria, which also includes coral and sea anemones. They are often called jellies, or sea jellies. Jellyfish come in many different shapes and sizes, and they are found in all of the world's oceans. They are known for their bell-shaped bodies and long, trailing tentacles. These tentacles are used for capturing prey, which is typically small fish and plankton. Jellyfish are also known for their stinging cells, called nematocysts. These cells contain a toxin that is used for both defense and capturing prey. The severity of a jellyfish sting can vary depending on the species, with some being harmless and others being deadly. Now, let's talk about the Turritopsis dornii, also known as the immortal jellyfish. This jellyfish is found in all of the world's oceans, and it is about the size of a fingernail. It has a transparent, bell-shaped body with short tentacles. The reason this jellyfish is called the immortal jellyfish is because of its unique ability to revert back to its juvenile state after it reaches maturity. This is a process known as transdifferentiation. Essentially, the jellyfish's cells can transform into different types of cells, allowing it to regenerate its body and start anew. This means that the Turritopsis dornii can essentially live forever, as long as it doesn't get eaten or killed. When it reaches maturity, it reverts back to a polyp stage and starts the cycle all over again. It's a truly incredible ability, and one that has fascinated scientists for years. So, how does the Turritopsis dornii do it? Scientists believe that the jellyfish's ability to transdifferentiate is linked to several factors, including stress, injury, and environmental conditions. When these factors are present, the jellyfish can trigger the transdifferentiation process and start its regeneration. The Turritopsis dornii has captured the attention of scientists and researchers for several reasons. For one, it challenges our understanding of aging and mortality. If a jellyfish can essentially live forever, what does that mean for other organisms? Could we one day find a way to replicate this process in humans? But beyond its scientific significance, the Turritopsis dornii also has practical applications. For example, its ability to regenerate its body could hold the key to repairing damaged tissues and organs in humans. Scientists are currently studying the jellyfish to understand how it can do this, with the hope of applying this knowledge to regenerative medicine. Additionally, the Turritopsis dornii's ability to survive and thrive in a wide range of environmental conditions has led researchers to study it as a potential model organism for studying stress response and adaptation. By understanding how the jellyfish can adapt to different environments, scientists may be able to apply this knowledge to help other organisms, including humans, adapt to changing environments. Despite its remarkable abilities, the Turritopsis dornii is not invincible. Like all organisms, it faces several threats in its environment. One of the biggest threats to the jellyfish is human activity. Pollution, overfishing, and habitat destruction all pose a significant risk to the jellyfish, as well as to other marine organisms. In conclusion, the Turritopsis dornii is a truly amazing creature. Its ability to revert to its juvenile state and essentially live forever challenges our understanding of aging and mortality. But beyond its scientific significance, the jellyfish also has practical applications for regenerative medicine and studying stress response and adaptation. However, like all organisms, the Turritopsis dornii faces threats in its environment, including human activity, natural predators, and climate change. 
It's important that we work to protect this incredible species and other marine organisms by reducing pollution, overfishing, and habitat destruction, and by taking action to address the impacts of climate change. Thank you for tuning in to this video on the Turritopsis dornii. I hope you enjoyed learning about this fascinating species of jellyfish. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more ed.